Your baby daddy look like cock. Pumping on the fatty food, something out of Cali with an eyes thicker than Miss Parker, bitch. Piece of wood underneath there. All right. So one of the things I've been meaning to do with this whole sub setup is I don't know if y'all can see it. Get the light out. The factory sub is still there. It, it ain't hooked up. I'm about to take it out and show y'all how to do it. I just put a board underneath the box and everything because it was falling into the floor. That's what the last video was with it playing. I got it strapped down to this point, goes over, goes to this point, and the other one goes to that point. There, so you can see it. Got my first aid, my manual, X12 or X15 sundown. It's been reconed. That's why there's no sundown sticker on there. Yeah, about to pop this back seat out. Got the 2K on a piece of board I cut out. It fits in there good. Yeah. Hopefully we can get some air in the cab now. But son of a bitch. Door lock actuators started to go out after I got the car titled. It's kind of a pain in the dick. But also, I don't know if y'all can tell it. Uh, here's the the damage from hitting the barriers. And then the grill. But. $800 car, I'm not worried about it. I mean, I'm gonna make it nice again. I got another car I'm getting that's black with black interior. I already found one. I'm pumped to get it, but how to take these back seats out. There's a clip right here, but all you gotta do is just get near that clip. That's my base wire. Get near the clip, just put your hand in there and yank on it and then the whole bottom piece comes out and I haven't taken this out before so no telling what we're about to find should probably set this down but all kinds of change under here there should be a few 12 mils right here another one right here one right here one there one there across. I'm gonna take those out, pull this out, and get back to y'all here in a second. All right, so Lexus is pretty sneaky. There's the 12s that are under here. And if you look up here, a little flap, you open it up, and there's another one in there that's also a 12. 
There's one on the other side, I'm guessing, too. I don't know about this one. I can't get that one up right now, but yeah. So, there's two more 12s underneath the headrests. All right, and you just tilt that whole thing forward. Probably help if you move the front seats a little forward, but we're just trying to get to this rear speaker. There's three 12 mils on top for the, the harness for the baby seats. And you just get your little forks here, these clips, pop them up. Under there is your speaker. I really don't want to take these uh these pillar covers off, so I'm gonna try to do it without doing that. But if I have to, I'll show you how to do that too. All right. Okay, so I did have to remove that piece on the on the pillars, but honestly, these clips are pretty strong compared to you know. Nissans and how old they are They're about as strong as like the infinity clips. They didn't just explode taking them off and these things are 20 years old almost so Just goes to show you that Lexus is pretty darn good at keeping their shit together with these clips But the best way to do this the uh, pretty much the dealership way so you don't fucking You know put a pinch or a bind on any of this stuff or stain it you just pull the weather strip up You'll pop this piece, which is the trim, the trim piece, which is first. Pop it up, pull the corner off of it, which is that. Then you'll be doing the, the bottom, then the top, then the middle. Then you can get to that one, and then that one. And the last one you just kind of push on, and it will normally stay in the car. Back there it will stay. And then you just pop it off with your clip. But yeah, now we can... Pull this out. Don't forget to unplug your third brake light. And then there's the sub. I can take that thing out and hopefully that will kind of act as a port now for the trunk. I'll actually get some air and some volume into the cab with my 15. All right, now that we got that out, we have a big gaping hole. And this does make it easier for you to change your, your lights out, by the way. So, I mean, when you have this off, go ahead and do it. Like, I had this one out. So, I went ahead and changed it. Don't know if y'all can see that. But, there's a little break in there. So, I changed that out. I'm gonna put this back in there. And put this all back together. And it's done. I am leaving the back seat out so I can uh, vacuum all this stuff. I'll probably do that tomorrow because my vacuum's full of uh, what is it? Walnuts from walnut blasting the beamer, which we'll show you an update on that in the next one of these next videos. But just how this all goes together, I mean. It looks like it's never been touched, like it's never been messed with. It's kind of what you would like, definitely for an older car. So, that's a goal for anyone that's doing something like this. Just pulling some shit apart, trying to get back together without breaking it. And you know, all my amplifiers and shit. They're pretty hidden. I mean, unless you're digging in here, you're gonna find them. But other than that, you never know it's there. Yeah, I'm gonna play it, see if it's uh, any louder, if it's some some volume actually gets in here, some air. And here's the old subwoofer for comparison. Kind of funny, they look a little similar without nothing on the dust cap. I guess that's like a factory factory 12 I have to measure it but 
I'm sure it still works. I'll hook it up in the house later. But yeah, that's about roughly 3,000 watts on a 2K, so it's only pushing, you know, probably 1,800, something like that. And yeah, it's solid in here now. Got the piece of wood underneath there to support it. Got my, my manuals and first aid. <coughs> She's strapped down. So we're gonna let her eat here in a second. We're just gonna start with the same song from last time. With the seat not in here, I can kind of hear my fuel pump. So that's different. Probably turn that light out or else I forget. There. And it's probably gonna hit right off the bat. I do think a little bit more volume is getting in here because things move around a little bit more. Let's play another song. Let's do a uh, choppers. This one's a pretty good sniper. Some old mafia. I know it's pretty loud in here, but outside the car it's not as loud. I'm shooting shit up like a dolphin. Put a hole in your head like a dolphin. I'm putting holes in one. No golfing. I'm 
pretty sure it's louder. Like, even in the car, it kind of gets your, your hair moving a little bit. That's what's up for 115.